grilled chicken breast, we're grilling it. We marinated this breast for 24 hours. We do use a skin on breast, which actually, and we will grill it skin down first, which will actually help protect the moisture of the chicken and give it a lot more flavor. So we have a grilled chicken breast, I'm gonna slice it down the middle. We're gonna put our cheese mixture. Our cheese mixture actually has mozzarella, Monterey Jack, and Chihuahua cheese. Roasted poblano peppers. What we do is actually put them on the grill, roast them and char them on all sides. Now we're gonna put this into our salamander. We do it in the oven. While we're melting our cheese, we're actually gonna make our cilantro mashed potatoes. Take our mashed potatoes, which we make here fresh every day. Whole potatoes, cook them, add the cream and butter, the good stuff, you know. We're gonna add a little bit of cilantro. Just mix them up. I guess this is, this is a great complement to our chicken. Cilantro is actually comes from the coriander seeds. Coriander and cilantro are actually the same thing. Got our cheese nice and melted, and then we have our heated up our poblano peppers. I'm just gonna top this, move the whole thing over on top of our mashed potatoes. We're gonna add just a little more cheese on top. Can't ever have enough cheese in Mexican food. Melt that. All right, so we've melted that cheese on top. You can see the ooey gooey melted cheese. We're gonna add salsa verde, which is a tomatillo sauce. Tomatillos are similar to a green tomato. They actually come in husks. We clean the husks off and we add some jalapenos, some cilantro, and some onions to it. We're now gonna finish the plate off with some salsa verde, and I will top it off with just a little bit of red chilies. The red bell pepper actually gives it just a little sweet flavor, which actually complements the dish very nicely. This is our pollo relleno, my favorite dish. I truly have never seen anything like it, and those cilantro mashed potatoes were incredible. Who knew? While that is Trey Gourmet indeed, what about the basics?